Hi everyone! We just got the new releases for November. Um, I opened the box, but we haven't actually um, taken the paper out or looked at any of the books yet. So, we all get to see them for the first time together. Kason is super excited. Alright, Mr. Crane, let us in. Okay, quicker though. Quicker! Quicker! Okay, let's see what we got. Okay, so we got a couple new books. We've got a uh, general knowledge word search. Those are always fun. This is something I like to do when we're in the car. Um, and an animal crossword puzzle. So let's see. Whoa, there's a book left in here. Okay, you open that one. See what's inside that. Oh. <gasps> Ooh, what is it? Let's hold it up. Can you hold it up and show everybody? He really likes these because all the wheels spin. So let's see where these ones, oh, it says cats delivery service. So they must be out delivering all sorts of things around town. What do you think is inside this box? What do you think it is? So cute little book. Then we have a first reading level one book, How the Crab Got His Claws. I'm going to put my, my book in my pile. Okay, so I'm that's kind of what the reading back. levels are like. And then at the back, there's always comprehension puzzles. So those are all super fun. See, How the Crab Got His Claws. Oh, this one, what's it called? I thought this so story. Children. Yeah, so these are Rudyard Kipling stories. And let's see, we've got how the elephant got his trunk, how the leopard got his spots, how the rhinoceros got his skin, how the whale got his throat, how the camel got his hump, and why the kangaroo jumps. So those are all the stories. It's a nice illustrated little collection. Just so stories. What else do we got? Oh, some mini books. I <gasps> Monster trucks snap. Oh, monster truck snaps. That's pretty exciting. I want to have that. Okay, I want to keep it. Put it in your file. So we got some more mini books. These are super popular. So coloring book with rub down transfers. Anything unicorn seems to be pretty great. So all of these little oh, rub down I transfers. Don't like that. Well, that's okay. You don't have to have it. So you can take all of these transfers out and then transfer them into the pictures and color. So there's unicorn, there's sticker shapes. This is Christmas. So you just take all the little shape stickers in the back and then you can make all sorts of Christmas pictures with them. Just wait, I got still. Okay, just hang on. Then we have Christmas puzzles. And also, um, a Christmas rub down transfer book. So there's the transfers and you can put them in this coloring book. Then look at this fold out solar system. So let's see. Oh, we've never had a fold out book like this before. Not a big one for, look at that. Wow. And it's double sided. We are going to have so much fun exploring the solar system. That is so cool. We get to learn all about all the planets. What do you think about this one? Um, this one maybe there's like Oh, one guess one. he doesn't love it. Ooh, a sticker book. Yay, yeah, I wanna have put those in there. Okay, so we have some new first little sticker books. There's Nativity Play. And these are reusable, 190 reusable stickers. And this one has over 300 reusable stickers. So you get to make it this way. So you get to put them all in the scene. You love stickers, don't you? And then look at this. A new sticker dolly dressing. Halloween. Halloween's coming in two more days. But look at these awesome stickers. When I look at this, I think of my niece Camry. I think she would love something like that. Ooh, ooh, this one is really good. This is called Oswald and Little Squash. Little Squash. 
And, and it says, why does the sun shine? Oh, we have a whole collection of, of books this size over here. We love this series. So why does the sun shine? What's it made of? And where does it go at night? Find out in this beautifully illustrated flat book. So anywhere where you see a question, the answer is right underneath. So why do shadows get longer and shorter? And then it teaches you right there. Or why doesn't... You like... <laughs> this way, I want to show some more pages. So there's why does the sun shine? How does the sun help us? Why are some places hotter than others? How does the sun move across the sky? What's the sun made of? And then a little did you know page. So that's Look cool. It. There's another phonics book. Oh, we disco he discovered some Look new it. phonics stories Look last it. night that he it's really... Called Flamingo plays bingo. What? A it flamingo is... plays bingo? <laughs> yeah. That is so funny. We it love is... these stories. The illustrations are so funny, and he just gets a, such a kick out of them. He was laughing so hard last night. Flamingo plays bingo. <laughs> okay. Ooh, there's a new stained glass coloring book. These ones are so cool. So you can use felt tip markers, um, pencil crayons. And on one side, it shows you kind of an idea of what you could color it like. And then on this side, you color it and then you can take the sheet out and hang it up in your window. And it looks like stained glass. So this is a Christmas themed one. Super cool. I want one stained glass. I have been really, Halloween. I've been waiting for this book forever. Handwriting. Wipe clean handwriting. This is going to be so helpful. So it teaches you handwriting, how to do pen patterns, how to join the letters, joining from the top, there's joining from the bottom, all sorts of tips to teach you handwriting. You can do the whole ABCs in handwriting. There's some simple words, some little games, there's like a little postcard they're sending with fill in the blanks. Look at, this is great. Look at this one. Handwriting. This one is also a white clean Maybelline phonics. Do you love phonics? No. So this is a great um, phonics book and introductions to letters and sounds. First reading. Okay. Look at this guy. Oh there's some more white cleans. We have white clean measuring. So this is rated for ages Five and five and six. All about measuring. Oh. Look at our four keys here. We like to charts, charts and graphs. Charts and graphs. So this is geared towards ages six to seven. All about graphs and charts. So that's awesome. Karis is going to be really excited about this one. She loves the graphic legends. So this is the Odyssey. And then we have one last thing. Do you want to get it out? Oh, no, there's a couple last things. There's two more things. What is this one? That's not my elf. I'm possible. Has cuddly elf. A, a cuddly elf? Where did you hear that? Learn that word, cuddly. There we go. Look at that. That's not my elf. It's like a gift pack set. So it has the, the elf and the book. Look at the Osborne Book of Nighttime. Big Book of Nighttime. Look at that. There is just something fascinating about seeing what happens throughout the night around the world. So, this is the kind of book that we love to discover and read together. So good night, lights out in the factory, outside, so beyond the town, just all sorts of things that are happening throughout the nighttime. Pretty cool. So, Kaysen, tell me, what was your number one most favorite thing that you've seen? <laughs> He's got them all ready to play with. Show them again. Monster snap. Should we open it up? Sit down for a second and yeah, look. Yeah, I want to see the clothes. Let's open it up and let's show everybody. 
Okay, so it has lots. So it's like a standard deck of cards. Um, and they're just... Can we play memory map? And yeah, we like to play memory map? match, go fish, old maid. So we have all sorts of different cards, and they are all monster trucks. So that's super cool. Okay, well, thank you guys for watching, and I hope that you enjoyed all of the new releases for November.